Welcome to the channel. I'm Scott with 1T, and we're back again today with our Let's Play series of Rise of Forbidden West. If you're new to the channel, do me a favor, hit that like button, subscribe, and leave me a comment down below. Just let me know what you think. And also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Scott with 1T for all my updates when we drop my content. If this is your first time to the channel, welcome. I put out uh, Let's Play content Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday. Um, they're typically story driven games, but if there's any games that you would like me to play or check out, be sure to leave me a comment with your suggestions, and I'm going to figure out a way how I can uh, get get some sort of uh, Let's Play series of that going. I also started up a gaming channel on Twitch. It's going to be it's Scott with One T Gaming, and I'm going to be doing some live streams of PC games like RTS and City Builders. So if you're interested in that sort of content, be sure to check me out over there. And yeah, we're just going to dive right on, in onto this. Uh, this game we did so many side quests the past few episodes it's been a it's been a grind but you know i don't i don't really cut my content that much you know i'll cut it if i'm dying a lot or something like that but i'm not gonna cut out main things that i'm doing side quests and things of that nature that's what this whole thing is all about if that seems boring and mundane you don't really like that i always put you know time timestamps in all my videos or I've been starting to do it recently I should say like 20 about 10 15 videos ago and you can you know skip along to do what or watch whatever section you want um but you know that's why I like that's how I like to play games and I like to enjoy the game and this is on the hardest difficulty so I have to you know get better gear I have to get, uh, salvage as much stuff as I can so I can get that gear. I have to do all that or I'm not going to be able to beat the game because the enemies are going to be way too hard and I'll just end up dying over and over and then that becomes boring to see. So, you know, there's a reason why I'm going through the, the grind that I'm going through. So hopefully everyone's enjoying it. I've been enjoying this game a lot. We're going to start the main story in this video. Uh, so that's going to be cool because we haven't done any main main story quests in quite some time. Uh, not to talk down on the side quests. The side quests are great. I think uh, a lot of them they have really good, interesting stories, and I enjoy them. And the acting is still good in those as well. So there's really no downside to them. It's just you know they're singular. There's no real doesn't move the plot forward. So just like you I'm wanting to see where the story goes but I needed to go through that catalog of side quests because I think we ended up with like 15 or something like that and we needed to work our way through all right well that's enough of me rambling on about it uh, let's just jump right on in today's actually a pretty um, cool day not cool but you know it's this video like, if you haven't noticed, I'm wearing the same outfit as my last couple videos because I've been doing them all back to back. So when this video releases, it will be on the day I come back from my vacation. So my grind that I've been doing to get all these videos recorded is, you know, finally at the end. So this video is special because it's also the video that releases when I get back. And then I'll the next video I'll be able to talk about you know, my vacation, how things went, if anything interesting happened, maybe throw in a couple pictures. Um, who knows? Wait, why is it telling me to go? What's happening right now? Oh, there's two things I got to do. Find Alva, go to Falls Edge. Okay. I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha. you. And I said before the end of the last episode, I wanted to upgrade my gear first. So let's see. See what we got. Can definitely upgrade this. 
don't have that, so we can't do it. Firestorm Warrior Bow. Did she just give this to me? No, I think I bought this. It's not much, though. It's just machine cores. Why not? Why not upgrade it a little bit? And... This is our sharp shot bow. Definitely want to upgrade this because we unlock another slot. I don't know what that means, but apparently you can create a job. I offer you an honorable trade. I don't know, there's, there's something out here. Oh, there's something all the way out. Wait, can I run into the waves? No way. I can. No way. Wow. That's cool. That is cool. So we're going to swim out to this location. Get that green, uh, green shine cluster. And hopefully there's like a, what you call it? Oh, there's a stingray. Look at that. This is cool. There's stingrays everywhere. Oh, I see, I see seaweed. So there must be a machine down here. Snap maw. Rules. There's any useful ones down here. My focus should be able to spot them. Just gotta be careful with all these machines. Should be a shock ammo.
Oh, I think I see, uh... How the heck I got up here, but whatever. Snap moss. I can get them on my side now that the override's fixed. Let's go. Swim as fast as you can, Aloy. All right, we can upgrade our sharp shot, and then we're going to go ahead and um, do that main, main story quest. I wasn't lying about it. <laughs> I was. We are going to go do it. It's cool that we can set these little jobs. Though I never did it before. Probably should have been doing it, but just just didn't do it. But I will for now on so that we can get better and upgrade our weapons more efficiently. I wish there was a campfire up there though. Jump up there. <laughs> Why am I leaping around? Because I'm trying to go upgrade my weapon. That's why. this green shine cool well actually I'll fit mmm who's this I just don't know what this like when did I get this outfit it was I gifted this you know That did have been a gift. Yeah, I had to have just gotten this as a gift. Look at the tattoos, man. I like it. 
It's not tattoos and it's paint. I don't understand how it stays on that long. Alright. Whatever. Let's go. He upgraded. That's what I needed. Let's... Head this way. <laughs> kid was like throwing a fit on the ground or something. Alright, we're sent to our stash. We're almost at level 40. I can't believe it. Can't believe it. Feels like so long ago when we were like level eight or eight or ten. We eventually need to do another cauldron as well. Oh, this is a race. Should I do a race? Eloy, you actually came. Couldn't stay away, huh? Just thought I'd check up on everyone. Mm hmm I heard he once raced a slaughter spine, just for fun. Think that's why he uses the mask? To cover the scars? What's everyone talking about? Red Teeth hasn't shown up to test a new track yet. Maybe he's scared he'll lose at this one. One of these days, his luck's gonna run out. And when I beat him, I'm gonna make him show me what's under that mask of his. You've never seen what he looks like. That's person who tried got beat up so bad. Pretty sure something got knocked loose in there. It was a great bond. <laughs> Doesn't bother me. All that really matters is what you do on the track. For now, we start the race without him. Josek, make sure she gets him out if she needs one. Sounds like racing red teeth would be quite a challenge. Right, like you'd race fresh meat like you. So you win or what? Let's do it. Let's race. Am I racing on my piggy? Oh no, they all get the same thing. Threw me off. Come on, come on. There we go.
Let's go. Let's go. Come on. I'm gone, bro. That took forever. Not bad for fresh meat, huh? Guess you might have a shot at winning against Red Teeth. Doesn't mean I won't beat you to it. You can try. Ax mentioned he found a new track up in Sky Clan territory, east of the Bulwark. You should come try it. If I'm gonna beat Red Teeth, might as well practice with a real racer. We'll see. <laughs> if I'm up that way, maybe. I'll make sure to sharpen my arrows. <laughs> Cool. All right. I think, uh, um, what do I want to say? I think, oh yeah, because we just did that whole race, I think it, um, it shows like all the map up here now because of that. It's actually a good way to like un unfog the map. Pretty good. Alright, so we're almost... Almost there. Look for landfall and over. Oh, is that over there? No one here. That's strange. Well, nothing's stopping me from taking the boat. Actually, gonna like row the boat, or it's just gonna 
fast travel me there. Be to the northeast. The heck happened here? It's like machines like just showed up and started destroying stuff. Where am I at on this map? Oh. So. Oh, I went from here to here. Oh, because there's probably a, uh, yeah, there's probably just a whole ocean right here. Okay, I get it. I understand now. Right, because claws and shredding jaws were enough. It's mountable? What? Yeah, lose those horns. What's this guy doing, man? Whoa. Messed that thing up. Got the antlers. Let that thing beat up everything. Spike trap. Oh, 
Thanks, buddy. That's cool. I didn't know this thing. These things are mountable. Stay still, man. I don't want to go to that. this thing at oh this guy do I want this thing I'll let him take you out oh This thing is freaking a beast, man. Just a beast. Alright, I saw fire gleam over here. Curious to see if I could like pick it up or something. I figured if I can get this tall neck, then I'll see large part of the map. I don't think you can. The tall knight that's the signal. I don't think you can uh, follow me, bud. Where? Uh, 
Oh, that's, this is cool. So it likes, it doesn't like fire, so we need to get the fire bow out. Those tall parts must be up there somewhere. I just have to get to them. a good salvage over here I guess this is how you like level up and oh I get it I get it I get it so you go in here pull it in pull it over and then we can jump on it oh wow more stuff We're gonna do the main story. I, I'm, I promise. I know. It seems like I'm getting a little sidetracked, but I'm this. definitely gonna do it. This is where those sunken tonic parts ended up. Explain to me why you would do that. Aloy, come on. Come on now. Jump on there. There you go. There we go. These things are freaking yelling. Down on me. 
Looks like the part I'm looking for. One down, one to go. And I bet the other part is over here. Climb on this. Damn it. Oh, great. I don't know how I ended up in here. <laughs> Doesn't like fire. Of course not. Trying to figure out where the heck this thing's at. The second tall night part. I'll be taking that. All right, buddy. I'm sorry, you gotta go. I don't feel like dealing with those guys, so we're gonna. Oh my gosh. I guess we're gonna run up the stairs. Sorry, guys. Gotta run. Yeah. Perfect. of the parts I need. I should get these back to the Talmak. Could shoot it with fire.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eating, eating berries underwater. You didn't know you could do that. So now we'll be able to see the whole map. And that's perfect. Just pulled that out of nowhere. Really? I like all these underwater structures. Where are the sharks at? Janky as hell. Nice. 
Nice. Perfect. So I have to go back that way just to get to the fire or the campfire. Um, I don't think, I guess maybe we won't be able to get to the main, main quest in this episode. I didn't know it was going to take <laughs> all this effort just to get here. swim the shore and then we'll make our way over to Pharaoh Pharaoh's tomb A, he's a beast, this guy. I hear, I hear that drone. That must be the entrance to landfall up ahead. Hey, hey, is that her? The living ancestor. The diviner wasn't. Li this is landfall, right? I'm looking for Alva. Overseer Bohai ordered us to invite you before him. Should you approach, please, come with me. Go. Let him know we're coming. It's her! The Diviner was right. Overseer Bohai, a stranger just walked through the gate. I knew Alva would not dare lie. You do look like Sobek. Is Alva here? I need to talk to her. I will consider your request once it is determined what you are. 
a living ancestor as Alva believes, or a threat lurking in such a guise. I am no threat, okay? Back on the mainland, your soldiers fired on me without warning. So you say, infidel. None of those you engaged survived to bear witness. I held off on your squad when... May I present our honored CO. So, here she is. Our great mystery. Well, Bohai, what have you divined? What is she? A mystery <laughs> indeed, my CO. How can she appear as Sobek, and yet know nothing of our ways? Are we to believe that a living ancestor was born to this wretched land, an ocean apart from the realm of the Chosen? And if so, to what end? I cannot answer. Only she can. But I warn you, no falsehood will satisfy us. Now speak. Why are you here? What is your purpose? I'm looking for a place called Thebes. And what do you seek there? Alva told me a little bit about what you're after. I guess you could say I want what you want. A way to heal the world. As I suspected. Tell her. We <laughs> found Thebes. The final resting place of Ted Pharaoh's secrets. It isn't far, but the way is closed to us. Machine attacks have cut us off from the site. Diviner Alva is there, along with a complement of diggers and soldiers. Is she all right? Our scouts tell us that the machine has our people pinned behind their defenses, but they're holding out. Machines, huh? I can help with that. Alva told us that you are indeed formidable. But I have a few questions first. We will answer what we can. So you found Thebes. How? The ancestors revealed it to us not long after we made landfall. Almost a year ago, through a scrap of ancient data discovered by Alva and verified by myself. It contained details about the construction of a great underground palace. Where, exactly? Close. Beneath the Great Pyramid in the ruins beyond. Figures. Ted loves his pyramids. <laughs> Have you been inside? Uh, no. That has been a problem, one of many. And we will solve them all in time. Getting back to the site is the one at hand. I hope you're as effective against machines as Diviner Alva suggested. What exactly are you looking for inside Thebes? I thought Alva brought back the data you needed. We risked much to cross the ocean. Therefore, we must unearth every possible link to the legacy while we are here. Especially one as important as Thebes. We will not sail back until I have plundered its secrets. So, Alva reports to you. I was chosen by my colleagues on the Board of Overseers to supervise data retrieval on this expedition, yes. And you're in charge of the expedition? He is far more than that. You are addressing the cousin of the Emperor of the Quinn. Heir to the vast holdings of the Great Delta, the first CO in five generations. All she needs to understand is that I am the authority here, and my will is to attain the secrets of Thebes. 
Mine too. We're in luck. <laughs> you crossed the ocean on these ships? Couldn't have been easy. Greatness is never easy. Indeed. It took seven years just to build the flotilla. This expedition is the most important undertaking of our generation. A quest for knowledge across the gaping sea with nothing less than the fate of our tribe at stake. And none of it would have been possible without the will of the CEO. The voyage was difficult. The wilds here even more so. Our sailors and soldiers have suffered much. I know that. But all for the glory of the Quen. Good to know. <laughs> what kind of machine has your people pinned down near Thebes? A Thunderjaw. We've dealt with them before, but this one is... Tougher, stronger, and it has black armor? Yes. How did you know? <sighs> Doesn't matter. Won't be easy, but I can take it down. Then destiny shines upon us, as I knew it would. A living ancestor now walks among us. And she will help me attain the secrets of Thebes. Resupply here, if you must. Then on to Thebes, at the base of the pyramid in the ruins. We will follow when our scouts confirm you've cleared the way. Hmm. Oh, I guess oh, guess there's other outfits here. Hold up, let's go check out these people. People's clothes. What is this? Mixed gear. Better against the uh, like ice. Oh, what's this? Why? Like, why do they gotta have the stupidest looking thing? That actually looks pretty decent. I like it. This is like over the top. I like this one too. Pretty cool. Really good against fire. All right. I will await your return. I just wait for now, is there like uh, that's a stash? Curious to see where the um, weapons makers are. They have to have a. They have to have an armor, someone that makes the weapons. I guess it's on the ship. Big pyramid to fight the thunder jaw. All right, we're going to steal your stuff. <laughs> All right. I got like a, a shredder gauntlet. The legacy teaches us herbalist. Okay. That's. I don't understand. How do they not have a weapons person? Whatever. No big deal. 
let's do a quick save and this will be a good place to wrap up today's episode if you stuck around i appreciate it do me a favor hit that like button subscribe leave me a comment down below also don't forget to follow me on instagram and twitter at scott with one t for all my updates when we drop my content so we started up the main quest we did a couple other things you know we did the race and then we also uh un unlocked the tall neck so we could see this section of the map and we initiated the main quest story and so the next episode we'll see that story through and do any other residual missions that that come with that uh, i was really hoping to find some better weapons over here so kind of a bummer maybe there, maybe there's some other camp or something that will have an armor who makes weapons so hopefully we find that um and yeah i mean you know as i mentioned i'll be on vacation so you know the this has uh been a grind to get through all these videos so if they seem like they start declining or whatnot i apologize it's just it's a very exhausting it takes a lot of energy and effort but i hope it all comes together really well and everyone enjoys it and when i get back for the next video uh i'll talk about my trip to cancun and how things went probably post up a couple pictures in the video while i'm talking about it and uh yeah with that everyone have a good rest of your day and i'll catch you all next time see you